what's up everybody and welcome back to the channel in another video and this time I will be uh, yeah showcasing you this tank the firewall and I will be giving it a try in the firewall all seeing draw so I have this tank already and I know that this opening and this draw will be not that painful I will give it maybe a try for let's say three to five times maybe six times but not more and that what I always suggest you all guys to do in draws otherwise it will be expensive and the tank will be not that worth it for gambling I don't know 18k of gold or how much do we need here in this row in order to get the firewall for me as a player who got this tank already I want to give it a try of course because I am lucky enough I will get those 2.5k of gold compensation and yeah if we go it all in all risk we will be investing something about let's have a look how much exactly so we got here let's forget about the first 20 150 350 650 1050 plus 50 1100 1600 plus 700 2300 2350 33.5 plus uh, 250, 3.6, 4.6, 5.6, 6.1, and then uh, 8.1, let's say 8.3 plus the 20 from the beginning, and then uh, plus 3k gold. So, something in about 11k gold if you want to go it all in for this gambling which is really much more than the value of this tank so i will advise you to go maybe as i told you let's say yeah six to eight tries six to really not more to eight tries and with that you will be investing something in about let's say 2k of gold that's really okay because a tier 7 a premium tank it's not more than I don't know let's say 5k gold so let's go back and give it a try the first try here we go and with that investing 20k gold the all seeing camo this is what I have on, in my garage right now Fifty K gold for the second try. Again, fifty K gold for the third try. From the fourth draw, draw we got this scarab animated avatar. Let's keep going. Gambling here for the fifth time and I will go for another try and then that's it let's give it another try nope so no chance to get it after six tries and I will quit for that I hope you will be luckier than me and now let's play a battle with this vehicle to see uh, if this tank it's really worth it for you if you want to really go for it if this tank fits your play style in my opinion this tank is really um, a strong tier 7 heavy tank um, well enhanced armored upper plate and turret the lower plate is like most of the heavies not that strong but the upper plate and the front turret uh, we can rely on them to block some damage so uh, yeah it depends which way my team is going but if I am playing against uh, tier 8 I always prefer to go for example medium side because I know there if the mediums will push medium side they will struggle to penetrate my frontal armor on 
my way trying to cross to the middle maybe I can sneak some shots on the Tiger 1 let's see here we go nice another one maybe nope. come on come on nice okay let's keep going 531 of damage dealt with two shots and now let's keep pushing direction middle of the map so of course if you are interested to a full review about this tank if you have it or won this tank recently and all you want to know about this tank you can see uh, my reviews playlist I made there a full review about this tank talking about everything armor consumables equipment how to play with it etc just visit my reviews playlist for a full review um, no chance to bend that dude. Oh, somehow I managed to uh, penetrate his lower plate. I will keep pushing, but I'm alone. Nobody's helping. I need more help here. And uh, yeah, let's see. Ooh, another Yakpente is waiting there. He missed his shot. Oh man. Nope. Okay, alright. Let's fall back. I still need help here. Let's stay patient. Nice, 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 nice. The WZ110 is dead. And now I can push on this Yak Panther. Here we go. One, two, and maybe the finishing shot. He bounced. Nice. Here we go. Boom. Let's roll back again. Already. Right now I blocked, I think, three shots. And uh, this is showing us that or how good the frontal armor of this vehicle is. Oh, oh! I thought we were going to have some nice farming. The IS-6 is aiming on me. You know what, I will risk it, I don't care. I will just risk it. Here we go, aiming, 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 boom. One, Enemy armor is damaged. two, and three. Enemy oh, revoir, all in. All right, only two enemy tanks left. And just a reminder guys, in this battle we are playing against 3 tier 8 vehicles and I still blocked a lot of damage thanks to my strong frontal armor here. Maybe I can finish this CS, nice. Higher tier tank destroyed, 2 enemy tanks destroyed to now. And let's keep pushing. I don't think I will be fast enough to get the last vehicle, the T... Um, 23 E3, but who knows? I'm still hungry for damage. Already 2k damage dealt in this battle, and the Fire Wolf wanna go for more. We have here a full hit points, full HP T23 E3, but he's far, far away from me. I think my mediums will get him before me. We will see. Yep, that's it. The CS53 finished him. So, a normal average battle with this vehicle. I think that that's uh, this is or this is what you're going to expect from this vehicle from the firewall playing with this tank. If you know how to play with it like that, being patient, um, yeah, playing a bit hard down. We saw we can block some damage with this vehicle and uh, rushing on the enemy um, at the right moment. Uh, you can deal a lot of damage with this vehicle and this tank will definitely help you to win some battles and in my opinion also to uh, boost and rise and grind your win rate. I hope you enjoyed watching this video about this short showcase about the firewall as I told you a full review available in my channel just visit, visit my tank reviews playlist for a full review about this tank so i hope you enjoyed watching this video if yes don't forget to smash the like button subscribe to my channel if you are new watching my content and see you soon in the next video guys bye bye <laughs>